big time. It does he look like he's ready to take that next step? These fans certainly believe in him. This is the day of the jackal. That's what they think. We've seen him grow. We've seen him win the Commonwealth title. We've seen him defend it twice. We've seen him beat an unbeaten Mexican Raul Morales to claim the IBF Intercontinental belt. Looks like Hearn and Frank Warren are going head to head. The ratings were. This call is big legs, and here's Ricky Burns now. This is what we're here for. This is the big fight. This is the atmosphere everyone's tuning in to see. And they just want to see a wall and a tear up and these two are right back up with it. This could be very special. Ricky Burns, the 29 year old Scotsman, against Kevin Mitchell. The man from Dagenham, 27 years old, Terry O'Connor there, is the guy who's going to be officiating. And it almost doesn't need a big build-up, but you can absolutely guarantee you're going to get it now. Because we'll be hearing what's more in a moment or two. And the International Boxing Federation. Commonwealth representative of Ringside, Robert Smith. British boxing model from Charles Street in charge, John Williamson. IBF supervisor, Bob McLeod. Timekeeper at the mill, Dale Elliott from Hillsborough, Northern Ireland. The three scoring champions in the ringside this evening are Howard Foster from Doncaster, Ian John Lewis from Gillingham, and Marcus Lundell from Twitter. Finally, when the action commences, the star referee and show host of the action, once again, one of the world's highest, Mr. John Key from
fights and start with his punches. And I don't think he has enough for the Scottish factor. Just 